This is Gene Key, SkySurf News. Bluebell has now expanded its voluntary recall to all of its ice cream products. KVUE.com reports from Burnham. Bluebell Creameries expanded their voluntary recall to all of its products currently on the market Monday due to possible health risks from listeria contamination. The release was posted on Bluebell's website Monday evening, stating that enhanced sampling revealed half gallons of chocolate chip cookie dough ice cream produced March 17th to the 27th contained the bacteria. The recall affected all products made at all Bluebell facilities. The Broken Arrow, Oklahoma facility remains closed after Bluebell closed it in early April in an attempt to isolate the source of the listeria contamination. Blue Belt said it expected to resume distribution on a limited basis once it is confident in the safety of its product. Consumers who have purchased any Blue Bell ice cream are urged to return them to the point of purchase for a full refund. If you have a concealed handgun permit, you'll soon be able to wear that gun openly in public. KVUE.com reports from Austin. A bill allowed the open carry of handguns in Texas won final House of Representative approval on Monday. House Bill 910, passed by a 101 to 42 vote, is now headed to Governor Greg Abbott's desk for approval. The bill would allow concealed handgun license holders to openly carry handguns in shoulder or hip holsters. Many law enforcement agencies across the state have been vocal in opposition to the legislation. The Texas Senate approved a similar bill in March. Abbott has already indicated that he will pass the measure when it crosses his desk in two to three weeks. The State Vet Board is investigating a veterinarian who killed a cat with an arrow. KHOU.com reports from Brina. The veterinarian who bragged on Facebook about killing a cat with an arrow is being investigated by the Texas State Board of Veterinary Medical Examiners, according to the Austin Veterinary Medical Association. The board, which issues veterinarians a license to practice in Texas, has said it is aware of the incident but will not confirm or deny whether there is an investigation. The young woman was fired Friday by the animal clinic she was employed by after a Facebook post set off a social media firestorm. Her caption below a photo of the dead cat said, My first bull kill, LOL. The only good feral tomcat is one with an arrow through its head. The Austin County Sheriff's Office is looking into possible animal cruelty charges against the vet. This is Gene Key, SkySurf News. 